Tonight, detectives are investigating an arson at an Oakland Park church, and whoever did it also spray painted threats all over the building. CBS 4's Carrie Codd reports. Investigators say this is what vandals and arsonists did to the inside of a small storefront church. They set fire to a wall and wrote hateful, hurtful messages like Satan was here and threatening to burn the church down in six days. We don't know who do it. Wiz McLean is the nephew of the pastor. He said they had services here at Refuge Family Community Church late Tuesday night. Then they got a call around 6 a.m. on Wednesday about the fire and vandalism. Lane said it's a test of their faith, but they believe in forgiveness. God bless them, forgive them for everything they do. The vandals damaged the altar and other religious items, and they scrawled messages on the wall that we cannot air on TV, including singling out a woman named Jillian and a woman named Naomi. This message read, I waited so long to repay the favor. Call the police, and Naomi is dead. Boom. The pastor says he has no idea who those women are. I don't know who's Naomi. I don't know who's Naomi. I have not seen a crime like this one. Oakland Park Fire Rescue Division Chief John Preston said a slew of agencies are working on the case, hoping to find out who could commit such a crime in a house of worship. We will look at every little detail of this fire and make sure that we've uncovered everything that we can. There's glass here on the ground from a window on the outside of the church. And then take a few steps with me over here to the front of the church. More glass from a broken window at the front of the church and this sign says it all investigators believe this is an arson cash rewards are available for information that leads to an arrest contact crime stoppers at 954-493-TIPS in Oakland Park Carrie Codd CBS 4 News tonight